The red fox are most active during the hours between midnight and dawn, which may explain why they have whiskers on board, their face and their legs, that help them find their way. Their thick tails, also called a bush, is used not only as warm cover in the winter, but it also is. It's balance and as a signal flag to communicate with other fox. They also signal each other by scent when they urinate on trees or rocks to announce their presence. Solitary hunters they prey on rodents, rabbits, birds and other small game. They will also eat fruits and vegetable, fish, frogs, and even worms. The fox live in diverse habitats such as forests, grasslands, mountains, and deserts, and have also adapted to human environments such as farms and superban areas where they die on garbage and pet food. Red fox are usually together in pairs or small groups, consisting of families. The largest threats to the red fox population include habitat loss and fragmentation, exploitation, and hunting. In the early 1900s, red fox were routinely hunted as well as rice for their fur. Red fox fur was one of the most in-demand furs on the market, second only to mink. Habitat loss and degradation is a large problem for red fox population today. However, the species is virulent and with such a varied diet, they have been able to adapt to and flourish in agricultural and urban areas. Conservation The European Union, Canada and Russia recreate and restrict the tapping of red fox. European and North America impose designed hunting and non-hunting reasons for fox. Sunday morning rain is falling. Still some cover shell, some skin like that. Close your shortness and moments unforgettable. You just to fit the more that I mean Oh!